Hello YouTube world and welcome to my new YouTube channel Focus Knob and the very first episode. So I just got back from Goodwill and bought a few of these 35mm point and shoot cameras for a dollar each. You may be wondering why would I do that? Well, let me show you. My plan is to harvest the lenses and turn them into a loop or a jeweler's loop. So you may have seen jewelers use these lenses to inspect gems jewelry, diamonds, or a gemologist use them for inspecting rocks and crystals. You may even have some of these cameras still laying around your house, so why not repurpose them and give them a second life? It doesn't take much effort to dismantle these cameras. All you need is a screwdriver and some time to take out all the screws that you need to remove, and eventually you'll have the camera apart, and look at all that gears. Maybe I'll repurpose some of these gears. Five cameras and two hours later, I was able to harvest about 13 lenses. A few of them make for a really good loop, like these primary lenses. This is an acromat or a doublet lens. So basically it has two lenses. This one is also a good one. This one's a good one. And a few of them not so good as a loop, like these ones are too tiny to, to handle. And then this one's a concave lens, it's a single lens. And a couple of them are field flatteners, I believe. It has this curved lens on the rear. I think this is an aspherical lens. Here's another field flattener. With the aspherical lens, as you can see. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with these lenses. But for these acromat lenses, perfect as a loop. And if you if you join them end to end like this and put a tape over it, like what I did here, that increases the magnification. I'm not sure what the magnification is. I'm guessing maybe 30x. But it works really well. And what I like about these lenses is that they already come coated with the anti-reflective coating. No need to pay premium prices for them. You wouldn't you wouldn't find these in a cheap loop. So this is nice. It's got that deep blue purple which should increase with light transmission and let's check out how well this works let's see what Lincoln is doing there he is sitting on his throne so normally you wouldn't be able to see this with your naked eye but with the with the loop you'll be able to bring this like within an inch close to your eye and you'll be able to see details you'll never see with just your naked eye and here's the tip of a pen it's a mechanical pencil Here's the tip of a ballpoint pen. So, so this is a nice little project. And I like this one, it already comes with a handle. I don't have to fabricate a handle for this one. 
but for these I'll have to make something up to make it easier to handle here's another one that has a handle already so here you have it it's a nice little project and it didn't cost that much thanks for watching please give the video a thumbs up if you liked it and let me know and if you don't like it leave a comment down below also please consider subscribing to my channel for more future projects all right until next time see ya